Welcome to the Google Earth tutorial on adding paths and placemarks. I've zoomed in on an area in Auckland today and again along the top we have our toolbar. I'm going to click on the drawing pin to add a placemark. I can drag and drop it to where I want it to be. I can give my placemark a name and add a link. OK. And I can change the style colour. Let's go for pink to stand out amongst the houses. And OK. Let's OK that. And here's my placemark. OK, if we come back up to the top and I'm going to click on Paths. So I can add a path, give it a name. I can add a link. Get the URL. Copy it. And paste that in. Click OK. We're also going to add an image to our path. Select the URL and copy it. And paste it in. OK. Change my colour. I'll stay with pink. Now you'll be tempted to click OK here. If you do, your path will close before you've added a path. So don't get into that habit. OK, let's give ourselves a little bit of room. And to add a path, click on one spot. Move your mouse down the road, click again. And you can see where my path has gone. Now in Google Maps you can snap your path to the road. Let's just check our measurements. And I've got it set to metres, so that's fantastic. So I can see that my length is 1,212 metres. Now I can click OK. And here's my path and my placemark added to my Google Earth. And if you need to edit any of them, right click, Properties, and that brings up all the things that you can edit on your placemark or path. Back up the top of my toolbar, I can click on the video camera to record a tour. I'll show you that another day. Well that's all we have time for in this tutorial. I hope you enjoy adding paths to your Google Earth. Good luck everyone.